we organise this conference because it's um, important to us as a centre and as a research group to have a presence in the community, to be outward facing um, and our main interest really is to uh, think about the complexities of children's lives. I think the conference today is kind of represents a lot of the work that we do in the faculty. It's engaging, it's impactful, it's outward looking. With, with these um, different research groups we're able to bring together people who have got similar interests and allow them to work collaboratively. So lots and lots of different kind of work that's, um, that has at its basis an, an interest and a focus on social science and, and how we view the world and how we live in the world. We're delighted with the turnout. We've got participants here from policy, from practice, academics, um, and it's been an opportunity for us to showcase the work that we do here in the faculty, um, but it's also been a great opportunity to network and to get to know um, colleagues in the wider field. The Child Wellbeing Centre is very much part of our core work, and through it we conduct research and we link up with professionals in policy and in practice and also with members of the local community. And we're absolutely delighted to welcome people from all spheres of activity who are concerned with children to the conference today. Today I was talking about the big research project that I'm involved in Scotland, which is following um, a huge cohort of children who are looked after or looked after and accommodated before they're age five. And what helps children feel safe and secure? and what helps carers and adoptive parents meet those children's needs. Um, well, a lot of my work within childhood studies has um, looked at the nature of childhoods both in majority world countries and in minority world. Um, and the paper I presented today looked at how there's a lack of dialogue between those different global areas, that there are two separate literatures. My argument was actually we have a lot to learn, particularly in relation to children's agency. The workshop that I did this morning um, was focused on uh, trying to support children and young people um, to have a, a voice about things that can sometimes be difficult to articulate.